Welcome to What Wendy Wears. My name is Wendy, and today I have a fabulous haul from Fashion to Figure. Now, Fashion to Figure, I remember when it first came out because it branched off from New York and Company. Now, New York and Company has a lot of identical clothes that you could find at Fashion to Figure for a little bit less expensive because it's a straight line clothing versus plus size. And that's one thing about Fashion to Figure that I was kind of irritated about is because the items that you can get on fashion to figure that you could also get on New York and Company, they're about 10 to 20% more expensive on fashion to figure. But all of the items that you're gonna see here today, with the exception of one item, are all from fashion to figure. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at all of them. I'm super excited. So let's go ahead and get started with the first one. Fitville is an ergonomic footwear company with the mission to enhance footwear experience. At Fitville, they believe in the power of a good pair of shoes to change life and the right to live pain-free. Shoes are bridges that empowers us to reach our goals. I was lucky enough to have Fitville provide me with two pairs of shoes, one for me and one for my spouse. We have been using this on our daily walks and I could honestly say I absolutely love them. They are comfortable and the fact that they have wide and extra wide shoes for every type of foot is absolutely great. So go ahead and try a new pair of shoes. <laughs> So the first item from Fashion to Figure is part of the Ga uh, Gabrielle Union line. And uh, it is a jumpsuit. And I absolutely love this jumpsuit. I just kind of wish that it had like a little button here. So that way these two pieces would close and I didn't have to wear like a cami underneath. Because it keeps opening up and you could see my bra underneath. I guess if I wore like a really low cut bra, it wouldn't have that issue. But I love the material. It is super thick and it has a little bit of stretch to it, not too much. I ended up getting this in a size one, which is I believe their size 16. Now, in order for you to put this on, it has a button here and then a button on the inside. And then it also has the zipper here in the front. So once you get that and then you slip it on, there is um, no t uh, pulling overhead or anything like that. So I absolutely love this. You know, I was like thinking about like this little button here. If, you know, if I bend over, will it come off? But the, it has like a little bit of stretch on the waistband, which I absolutely love. This um, jumpsuit has pockets and the length of it. I'm 5'5", five five, I have heels on, but it goes just to, the, uh, to my heel. So it's like a perfect for me. Now, what I do like is the way it makes my bum look. I think my butt looks pretty good in this jumpsuit, which I absolutely love. And um, it defines your waistline here. I know it's a little bit high, it's a high waistline, but you know what, this is the smallest part of my body. So I love the fact that that is where it hits. And just the length and the fact that it has pockets, I absolutely love it. So tell me what you guys think about this jumpsuit. I mean, I really love it. Um, you know, the only thing I wish with fashion to figure is that they didn't raise, they wouldn't raise the prices from fashion to figure and New York and company since New York and company also has the same line with Gabrielle union and their prices are a little bit pricier on fashion to figure. So this outfit is two pieces. It is the blouse along with the pants. We'll start off with the blouse. I love the look of this blouse. I really do. Problem is, is the neck. So it has two little buttons up here that you're supposed to button up. The top button is very, very hard and I feel like it's choking me. So if you have like a thicker neck, this is not gonna be for you. You're gonna wanna leave it undone and I don't know how that looks with the neck just open like this. Um, I think it looks better closed, but you guys tell me what you think. Do you like it with the neck open or closed? But I do love the fact that it has this little peekaboo when it comes to your chest. And then from here, it is pretty fitted, which I do really love because it has like this corset style look on this shirt. So let me bring it just a little closer so you can kind of see it. I know it's a little wrinkly. I should have um, steamed it. But overall, I just like the way it looks, but the collar is just way, way, way too tight. Now, the jeans or the pants are a faux leather. 
Now, when I took them out of the package, it had a slight scent to it. It wasn't really awful, but I mean, I could still smell it. I don't know how these are gonna, uh, how they're gonna smell after you wear them for a while. I mean, um, they are comfortable though. They're super soft and slick, which I do like. They have pockets, not only in the front, but um, functional pockets here in the back. And they're just like a real pair of pants. They're not a pull-on. They have buttons, they have zippers, and um, I just like the look of them. And I've been looking for a pant that's just a straight leg, faux leg. But you know what? I don't know how I feel about these just because of the smell. I'm afraid that if I'm wearing them for too long, they're gonna have like that weird smell that comes out of faux leather. But at this time, I haven't smelled it, so I'm, I'm actually pretty happy with them. And I like the way they look. Super soft, super comfortable, super slick, and they have functional pockets both in the front and back. You can't go wrong with them. Both of these pieces, I got them in a size one. So this piece is just a skirt. This is a faux leather skirt, and I really, really, really like the way it looked on the model, but I don't know. It fits me kind of weird. Um, I, I kind of like it, but I kind of don't. I love the pleating. I love the color. I think with a black top, it probably would look a lot better. And then um, in the back, it doesn't have all the extra um, pleating. It just has the little pleating down at the very bottom. And I like the fact that it's not a very short mini skirt. It is a pretty good length. Um, and it does have um, a belt that it comes with. The belt can be removed. It is a zip closure on the side. So it was a little hard. I had to kind of pull it up, uh, pull it around and then zip it up. But overall, I mean, it fits me well. It is a size one, um, but I'm not sure how it fits. What do you guys think about the skirt? Let me know in the comments below whether I should keep it or return the skirt. So this next item from Fashion to Figure, it's two pieces and we have a cat suit and we also have like this sweater cape type um, item. So I ended up getting this in like an emerald green. I absolutely love, love, love this color. Now it is a sweater material and as you can see, it's cut off all in the front but it has like a cape in the back. And I like it. I think it looks really good. I ended up getting it with the cat suit because I think I did see the model on the Fashion to Figure website have it similar to this. Um, it might have been that she was wearing a dress and I think even with the dress it would have looked great. But I like it with the cat suit and the cat suit is like a cotton and it does have some stretch but it's not real, real stretchy. And it feels more like a cotton material versus a spandex. And I love the fact that there is so much seams. So it gives your body some curves and dimension when you are close up. So it has like a seam here. It has the seam going down the front of the legs. And it also has the seams in the back to kind of shape your booty, which is nice. So now if you're trying to think, oh, what does the cat suit look like? So let me show you, but let me show you the sweater. It is ribbed and it has the thumb hole opening, which I do love. And it's just super, super comfortable. And I love the fact that the sleeves are a little bit bigger. So you have plenty of room when it comes to the sweater. Let me show you the cat suit. So this is what the cat suit looks like. I am wearing a bra underneath. I probably need to put on a better bra, but it does have like this double um, shirt type looking item here in the front. So if you can see, it has this part and then it has the, the top portion. So it kind of looks like you're wearing a cami underneath. And then it does have two straps on the shoulder as well. And they are adjustable, which is nice. So this is what it looks like from head to toe. I really do like it and I really think that they are tall girl friendly. I'm 5'5 five five and I still have about three inches down at the bottom for the legs. And I have pretty long legs. So I usually have like a, a size um, 30 length or 32 length when it comes to the legs. So I absolutely love the, the way it fits. I love the fact that it has the seams and the butt to kind of shape you. 
and it is super super comfortable folks it's it feels like you know you just have like a pajama on because it's so so comfortable but it looks really really nice so this is the last piece, and this piece is from the Gabrielle Union line. Um, interesting story is that I thought I bought this at Fashion to Figure, but I actually bought it in New York and Company because it arrived late, and it arrived at the same time that my Fashion to Figure products came in. And um, lo and behold, when I was doing the price comparison, the prices were actually better on New York and Company versus um, Fashion to Figure. This is a size double X from New York and Company, but they have the same dress at Fashion to Figure. So I will put the link below for both New York and Company and Fashion to Figure because depending on the size that you are interested in, then you could purchase it accordingly because New York and Company only goes up to a double X, which fits, I believe, up to a size 20. So you may be interested in getting it at uh, Fashion to Figure depending on your size. But overall, this dress is a very thick knit material. Um, I just tucked in my bra straps on this. Um, I don't know if I really like it because of the white on here. The white kind of shows every little nick and cranny on my body, which I'm not a fan of it showing. Um, but I love the fact that it has the color blocking with the three colors. So this is the front. This is the back. Um, I love the length of this. This would be very appropriate for work and also a date or something. Um, only thing is, is that it fits me a little loose here on the top. Um, maybe if I had some tape to tape it down, it'd be okay. But I just, you know, for the price of it, I wish it would fit me a little better. And I'm not flat chested. I mean, I wear um, a size D cup when it comes to bras. So I'm just very surprised that it fits so big up here and it being knit, it could stretch out very easily. So when it comes to the dress, I love the material because it's such a, a thick knit material, but unfortunately it just, I don't feel like it goes well with me and my body, but overall um, it's okay. So there you have it, folks. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit the like, subscribe, and the notification bell below as new videos do come out weekly. I went ahead and put all of the items in the description box below. So if you are interested, you could just click on it and it will head on over to the Fashion to Figure or New York and Company website. So on that note, if you like seeing pieces like this, um, I do also style my clothing on my Instagram page at What Wendy Wears. And there you can get ideas on how to style some of these clothing that you see in my videos. Um, also, I placed a video here that you might be interested in. And I placed my image here at the top to make it a lot easier for you to subscribe. I see you guys watching. So why not just subscribe and get weekly notices by hitting the notification bell that these videos are coming out? Well, thanks for watching, folks. I'll see you in the next one. And stay stylish, my friends.